I'm Adam Fugit. We're here with Midwest Outdoors. We're in Southern Illinois. It's the second firearm season. Temps have been dropping all week. Deer have already been moving. So it looks like we're gonna be in for a pretty good set. piece of properties overran with does. Hopefully could take a couple out and fill the freezer. So our land's a 40 acre block of timber that's connected to some continuous woods down to the southeast. Uh, we're set up on the downwind side of this three to four acre food plot that we've been working on for the past few years. We'll try to get in here during the off season, do some edge cutting, really open up the canopy, try to get as much sunlight to the ground as we can to help promote some good undergrowth for the deer. Uh, the does like this area, they'll come in, they can bed, they have browse all season. Uh, where our stand's positioned during the rut, the bucks can travel between us and the thicket and they're able to wind check that entire bedding area for any hot does. Uh, they can do that without ever stepping foot into the actual thicket. like they found a cup pile or two. I just want to take a quick second to talk to you about Scent Killer. Uh, it's a great product. I've been using it for years. One of the advantages is you can pre-treat your hunting clothing with it, store it in a scent-free container, and it'll last up for 20 days. Personally, I like to use it, again, when I get to the woods, get all my hunting clothing on, I spray down real well, and I'll even use it again once I get into the tree if I work up a little bit of a sweat. White belly right there. It's down. All right. All right. It's a nice mature doe. Clean shot. I was lucky to get in here and be able to take this big doe tonight. Uh, my dad was lucky enough to harvest our number one hitless buck last night. So our plans changed today and we turned to doe management. So he, uh, he took a doe this morning. I was able to get one tonight. That's good for the property. Helps, helps even out the herd a little bit. So now the fun part, get to dragging and getting her ready to take home. <laughs> 